Leon? Yeah, Leon, they both tell me two of the big projects going on right now. They have June 1st completion dates, and they have very little wiggle room, but they both say no problem. Above Lakeside, it rises 32 stories of glass and steel. The new 600-room Hilton Hotel. Inside the massive lobby, the finishing touches are being applied as the roughly 350 employees prepare for day one on June 1. The furniture is the last thing to come in. Um, we're back in the kitchens cooking, which is great. We're going to have some first tastings this week. Many of the rooms are already made up, with the Lakeside location offering spectacular views. The one thing that won't open June 1st is the 32nd floor sky bar, which will open July 1st. We're going to be extremely busy right out of the blocks, so we want to make sure that we execute that perfectly. We know we will. And we know there's going to be such an interest in the Sky Bar. We want to make sure that we execute that perfectly. Sharing that June 1st completion date two blocks away is Public Square, where the only person not in constant motion these days is Moses Cleveland. This crew's work to put the finishing touches on the $37 million overhaul. So much of the trees are coming in, and the grass is in, and the finishes are coming in. And people are finally starting to say, wow, like, look at what the square is going to be when it's done. Work is focusing on finishing off the square's new cafe and the water feature that will have a reflecting pool and fountains in the summer and ice skating in the winter. While construction will be completed June 1st, it will likely take some time after to remove the barriers before the square is officially opened. We'll be rolling out our plans for how the square is going to open and be available to the public ahead of the RNC and to sort of rededicate the square uh, in its new form for the next few generations. And while we're focused on June 1st as a date, June 2nd, remember, is the start of the NBA Finals, and the folks at the Hilton tell me they're already preparing. Reporting live in downtown Cleveland, John Kasich, News Channel 5.